Feeding our neighbors is still a huge challenge in Hampton Roads. Food insecurity has grown throughout the pandemic. And now food bank leaders are looking to the holiday season to make up for donation losses. Allison Basil shows us the challenges food banks are facing. 19 million pounds of food flew off the shelves at the food bank of southeastern Virginia and the eastern shore in 2020. And that was our highest number on record. So the demand is ever increasing. COO Bob Latvis says they are working hard to keep food on many tables. But 2021 is hitting them with new challenges. You see shortages at the stores. We see the same shortages in terms of donations from them. The food bank must make up for that gap from their own wallets, but rising food prices are another obstacle. The price for consumers, the price for us goes up, so we are seeing the financial demand on the food bank increase as well. Virginia Peninsula Food Bank head Karen Joyner says they are facing the same challenges. Right now, we're at about the lowest level of donations. But the holidays are just around the corner. Truly counting on this holiday season for the, for folks to really open up their, their hearts and, and really donate. In two weeks, food bank leaders hope to stack on donations during the Mayflower Marathon food drives in several parts of Hampton Roads. Canned goods, non-perishable items, and the only perishable items we really want are turkeys. Um, and then if you can't do that, you can certainly um, bring your monetary donations. Joyner says it's the biggest fundraiser for both food banks and a great chance to help your neighbors. In Norfolk, Allison Basil, 13 News Now. And the Mayflower Marathon food drive kicks off November 19th. Head to 13newsnow.com for donation locations.